welcome everyone to the jank yard it's jt it's time for the jank light of the week this is going to be uh one that just happened recently it was part of the channel fireball magic fest hashtag mtg together event um i it's one you pay money to get into and it's played very much like an event at a gp six rounds whoever finishes five and one or better gets to play on the weekend so this is round two i've won round one what you're going to see is games two and three i lost game one we're playing against just guy fires now i'll say right now i'm not playing a jank deck i'm sorry but because this was a money event and kind of serious i decided to play meta deck you can see what it is it fits my it fits me it's mono red beat down um you know that's it seemed right for me so you're going to see game two and then game three um, game three gets really fun because at a certain point, and you'll see me acknowledge it, the Channel Fireball uh, coverage team joins in because this was whole part of the thing is they encouraged streamers to stream at the same time and let Channel Fireball know that so they could do coverage on games by joining in streams. So it's Luis Scott Vargas and William Huey Jensen, two of the greatest players of all time, doing commentary and doing commentary on... Uh, on what happens uh, as the final game unfolds. So enjoy. All right, you're all good. Let's roll. Pass the turn. Cleave is faster than Torbrand. Yep, that's fair. Let's see what Rap Solo is thinking. Practice safe streaming. Yep, double bag it. Oh, you think? Oh, okay. Leave with the scorch. Because ultimately he could do four damage. Yeah, I don't leave with him as much as I should because I. I guess I maybe value haste more than I should. Well, it's the same amount of damage overall. Devout Decree. Oh, spicy. What is it again? Exile target creature or planeswalker that's black or red. Probably not going to become overly vital. He's threats after a sweeper. Okay. No, that's a fair point. Resolves. Let's light up that stage. There's our land. Let's get the Berserker out. Yeah, okay, so I'm seeing what you're saying. By turn three, Scorch does more damage. That's a fair. You're a fair. You, you've got a fair point. I think we play that Tybalt. No, let's hold off. They got another stomp for. Yeah, they do. Oh, right. He's a rogue. I forgot. There we go. 
Make a dude. Let's see if we can get at the spitter and the berserker out if we don't get the fourth red. There's fires. <sighs> He's got fires. He's got fires on tap. Oh boy. Sweeper protection. No attacks. Played Annex, but uh, Annex got annexed. If we don't draw land, we go Scorch Bitter Unchained Berserker. If we do, we go with Torbrand. Teferi's trying to decide what to bounce back. One of the devils. So that's his two plays for the turn. Okay, there's the land. I don't really feel like I'm swinging into it this turn, so I'm going to do this. Then we Torbrand the crap out of them next turn. Unless he sweeps. If he's got a sweeper, he's got a sweeper. I'm assuming he's going to play at least one of those giants. Yep. Or both of them. If he plays both, then maybe we come in with the Embercleave? No, we Torbrand this turn, Embercleave. Well, if we draw, no. No, no we'd have to. Mm. Ah! Like, I feel like we're close-ish. We just need... Uh, We just need to be able to get Torbran out. He's trying to decide what to do. Come on, Rapsola, what you got? Oh. Oh, yuck. Didn't discard any. Oh, uh, there's Kenrith. Oh, crap. Solve. That's damn near lethal. They don't get Vigilance, though, do they? So he's swinging for that. I'm counting 15. Okay. Okay. Do they get Vigilance? Did he give him Vigilance? No, no, no Vigilance. That's his two spells. Oh, yep. Yeah. Okay, hold on. Oh, boy, hold on. Hold the phone. That is now lethal. So if I block that, I take six 
1422. <sighs> okay, past the blockers. There. So that's 6, 12, 18 getting through is what I'm counting. That's 6 gets through. 12. Fifteen, twenty-one. Yep, my math says I'm alive. Oh, I should I should have blocked the Tin Street, not the Spitter. I wasn't watching what I was blocking with. Okay. I don't think this is enough. Oh, maybe it is. Yes! Yes! Whoa! Whoa! Yeah, I should have, it should have been the tin, not the spitter. I honestly was not looking until I blocked. That was dumb of me. But we got there. All right, Temple of Tiffany's. And away we go. Scorchy. I say, what about Temple of Tiffany's? Tin Street. Scorchy. All right. We're off and we're going wide. Oh, uh, well, crap. All right. Annex is a good way to restart. We've already got him to 15. It's something. There's fires. God, he's got fires on tap every time. It's like he's cheating. I'm sorry, did I just accuse my opponent of cheating? A little bit. Uh, there's our land for turn. No attacks. And we can play Unchain and Bone Crusher next turn. We just gotta fight through this. <sighs> Cavalier of Gales. Woof! Oh, I didn't think about Berserker for the Clarion. Uh, that was dumb. I was thinking Tin Street and Scorchy. And then, yeah, I, I went greedy and I paid for it. Suddenly not feeling so good. Hey, Channel Fireball, thank you for not thank you for coming here as I'm about to get crushed, not ten minutes ago when I got hammered for 21 down to 1 or 19 down to 1 and then swung for lethal with Torbran <laughs> uh, I'm just having fun uh, but this doesn't look good for me uh, 
welcome to the Jankyard Channel, Fireball. This is game three. Um, Rap Solo was on the uh, on the play, and uh, yeah, Torbrand would be nice right about now. Let's see what we get. Well, of course, Johnny Esports. I I would rather my Channel Fireball see me in my best light, not my worst. All right. Well, they hemmed in hot a lot with that flyer. Yeah, hit me to, for five. Come on, tour brand me. Ooh. Huh. I'm feeling spicy. Y'all feeling spicy? Give it to Annex. Well, hmm. Or do we give it to the Giant? No, we give it to Annex. All right, let's see what happens. Go to damage. Yeah! Oh my god, we did that. Believe in the cleave. Oh, oh wow. Whoa. I'm sure... You know, if Channel Fireball is still here, I'm sure LSV and Huey are like, he's got the win. What's his problem? But I didn't see it. <laughs> wow. All right. Oh. Oh. Oh, okay. I got to go report that. Oh, wow. Holy catfish, Andy. Oh, my God. We got there. Oh, my God. Okay, well, thank you for checking this out. I, I, as you saw, it was a crazy finish. Top decking that Ember Cleave was amazing. And even when I played it, I hadn't done the math, so I wasn't 100% sure that I had the win. And that's why I just celebrated so vociferously, because I didn't realize I had the win. Uh, you'll see... If you check out uh, Channel Fireball stream, go to their Twitch channel and check it out. Um, check out the five minutes that they covered. You'll see that uh, as soon as I drew the Ember Cleave, Luis Scott Vargas and Huey Jensen, who were commentating, they knew it. He, Huey just deadpans, oh, it's over. I might have screwed it up. It wasn't over. <laughs> but I played it right. And what an exciting finish. Uh, and I hope you really enjoyed it. So remember, if you want to watch more streams like that and watch me play other decks, jank decks, don't worry. I haven't gone away from jank. I just decided to play a meta deck in this event. Uh, please check it out. Don't forget to check out our other videos. Uh, the podcast is, is getting up and running. And uh, our weekly deck decks as well. Uh, remember that you can watch playing uh, jank decks or playing even playing this deck. You can watch on our stream. We stream regularly on Wednesdays and Sundays and also some other days too and we'll give you a warning on social media about that. You can find our stream at twitch.tv slash jankyardmtg and check out our social media at jankyardm on Twitter and jankyardmtg on Facebook to find out more and to find out when we're going live. So thank you so much for checking this out. I hope you enjoyed it. I know I did and if you did, uh, love it if you uh, liked and subscribed to this video. Thanks so much, and you have a good day.